guys, in the last video, we thought the hacker was Justin, but actually when we got there, he was all tied up and it was the hacker that captured him and tied him all up. And we also discovered that he is very powerful. He knows ninja skills. Yeah, if he can tie up Justin, he's gotta be pretty powerful. We need to step up our game and start training to prepare for this hacker once we finally meet him. So we are gonna go to the sharer's house and they are gonna help us train. It's gonna be a ton of fun, but how are we gonna get there because the hacker stole our Tesla? Yeah, he did give us the mini Tesla, but as you saw, on my last video, it's not very fast. So I had to stick with the mini theme though and got ourselves some motorcycles. Whoa, that is tiny. Just to compare, look how big I am uh -huh. compared to this little thing. I also got Chad one too. Oh, it's a blue one. Yeah. So cute. So we're gonna take this all the way to the sheriff's house. Let's go. Wow. Just like that. First pull, you're so strong. I know. Hey guys, I gotta start my motorcycle right here. Pull. Oh yeah. Oh, it died. Let me try it again. Oh, it again. Let me try it again. Give it a little, I'm gonna give it a little bit of gas while I pull the cord. Ah, too slow. Ah, too slow. Two thousand years later. You guys, I came back to help Chad because I was already like on my way. Oh, finally! I got it! Here we go. Woo! Oh my gosh. This is really fast. Oh my gosh. Here comes V. You, re you ready to go all the way to the sheriff's house? Yeah, let's do it! Woo! It's down here. Oh no. Where are we going? It's a dirt path, guys. This looks kind of dangerous. Give this video a thumbs up right here if you guys want us to go on the dirt path. You guys want us to go down here? It looks pretty scary. All right, I'm gonna go first. Good luck, me. Oh my God. Chad is having a problem with his motorcycle again. I think it's, it might be low on gas or something. You got it started, Chad? That branch almost take my head off. Yeah. Wow. There's another branch right here. Watch out. Oh. Whee! Ah. Whee! Ah. Well guys, both of our bikes ran out of gas. Yeah. So we're gonna have to leave them behind and start walking. And geez, there's so many, so bugs, many bugs around. This is such a tough journey. I think we're getting close to the sheriff's house. We yeah. just gotta walk a couple more miles, I think. Let's do this. Man. So hot. It's gotta be hundred degrees. The humidity. It's like over 100, I feel like. Yeah. We're sweating. I don't know, you guys. I'm just so out of it right now. We need some water, that's for sure. Yeah. I did see a creek a little further down. Yeah. Maybe we can get some water. Ow. I just hit my head on a branch. Dang it. I don't have that problem ever. Yes! Water! Woo! Feel like we've been dehydrated, you guys? Oh, water feels so good. This creek here yeah. is not too deep. Oh, I don't think I'll need my life jacket. No, you can swim in this. I'll just, I'll just use these rocks right here. Careful. Careful where you're walking. Oh, oh no, oh. Chad, you okay? My foot just fell in the water. It's okay though. Some, something's shiny right here. Oh, where? Right there, right Let's here, see. Chad. Oh, right there. Whoa, it's a triangle. Oh, you, pick it up. I don't want to. You don't want to touch it? All right, I'm gonna pick it up with this leaf though. Oh, I think the hacker's been here. Wait a second. Did the hacker want us to come here? Do you think the hacker already knew that we were gonna come you, here? Are there multiple hackers? And there's a hacker that lives here by the sheriff's house too, maybe. Gosh. There's multiple pond monsters. Maybe there's multiple hackers too. Maybe. What do we do now? Well, we better not drink this water just no. in case the hacker messed with it. Let's just try a different path. Maybe, maybe we should go this way. We've been traveling for about 30, 40 minutes on foot. We didn't think our motorcycle was gonna run out of gas in the middle of nowhere. Yeah. We thought that we can stop and get gas along the way. But I guess we do have our trusty backpacks to be prepared for anything. Yep. What, what are these right here, Chad? 
Oh, they're mushrooms. They are. Yeah. They're wild mushrooms. Now, some mushrooms you can eat and some you cannot eat. I do not know if those are good ones or bad ones. All right, I guess the best thing to do is do not eat. Yes. If you're unsure. Yeah, I don't like mushrooms anyway, so even if they were good mushrooms, I would not like them. <laughs> what about like on a Swiss burger? Nope. nope. I don't like any mushrooms. <laughs> and I also don't like poison ivies. We haven't seen any yet, but if you guys don't know what poison ivy looks like, here's what they look like. If you ever see them out and about, don't touch them. They make your skin all itchy. It's getting kind of dark. We better pick up our pace, Chad. Uh, uh, Jeez, we into the water. All right, guys, we've been walking for a very, very long time. It's gotten really dark. As you guys can see, there's rough roads that we've been traveling on. Where you're going, you don't need roads. <laughs> yeah, well, there's like rocks just everywhere. I, I don't like to be in the woods when it's dark, besides if we're camping, you know, but now that we're kind of on a journey, I would really hope that we're very close to life. Oh, do you guys see those? Little lights? Do you see those, like, I think they're fireflies. Guys, if you see anything, leave a comment down below. Oh, it's getting blurry. Look at this, every time I turn over here, the camera gets blurry. Well, what's wrong with this area? Yeah, out? maybe you should. It keeps getting blurry, like it doesn't want us to see what's over here. Let me get my ghost meter out then. Be careful. Your phone flashlight is on. It's glowing through the butt of your pocket. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Ghost meter. Wait. You hear that? Again. Sounds okay. like a dinosaur or something. What? There's oh, something no. back here. Oh, no, these, I'm not going deep in there. I don't want to either. Because it's like a it's like a tunnel through here. I think if we like bread this yeah. right here, then I think we can go through it. I'm not prepared for that. Normally we would do it, but it's just, we've been traveling all day yeah. and I'm really tired. I'm not sure if, if I have enough energy to deal with whatever happened to be back there. Okay. So I think we should just move on. All right, let's keep going. Did you hear that again? Yes. What is that? I keep hearing it. Dude, uh oh, I just found something. Check this out. Look at this. It's a golf ball. Why is there a golf ball out here in the middle of nowhere? Yeah. Do you think that's a clue from the hacker? Is or there? Just, or is there anything? There's some writing on it. And there's like a barcode on it. I wonder if we could scan this and it would tell us something. Yeah, we better hang on to this. This might be a clue. Let's keep What's going. What's this ball right here? It looks, it looks like a Nerf ball or something underneath the water. Kind of feel kind of creeped out because we use Nerf balls and then we found that triangle earlier. We should get out of the woods, Chad. Well, yeah, I'd like to get out of here. No. We've gotten muddy, it's super good. soft. I'm gonna not step over there. You gotta climb up these rocks here. <sighs> so steep. Whoa, you can do it, V. Oh, oh yeah. Light, there's daylight. We're out of the forest, finally. Wait, whose house is this? I think we're in someone's backyard. I hope they don't get mad that we're walking through their yard. Let's go ask them for some water because okay. I'm super thirsty. Huh, this house looks kind of familiar. Yeah. And there's a pond over there. And there are lights in the house. Yeah, someone's home, I guess. What's this creepy thing underneath the deck, though? I don't see anything. Why is it so dark? Oh. That's weird. Oh. Is this an abandoned house? Why would there be lights on if it's an abandoned house? Yeah, let's go check who who's in like the light and wait. What is this? Whoa! Wait. It's a safe. It's a safe. The safe looks so familiar. Weird. Do you guys recognize the safe? If you guys know where the safe is from, comment below right now or who the safe belongs to. Oh, every time I see a safe, it makes me want to open it or crack it. Yeah. This one's definitely been beaten. I mean, look at all this oh, damage. Wow. Look it's at this. a lot of damage. Or it's dented yeah. in, yeah. So whoever owns this safe yeah. is, has definitely been trying to crack this open, but they haven't really been successful at it. Yeah. This is a kind of a unique hey, case. Hey, who's that? What? 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 What's going on? What are you doing with my safe? What's going on here? Wait, wait. Carter! Carter? Oh! What? Chad and V! Whoa! What are, doing here? what are you doing here? I I live here. What do you mean? You, wait. What do you mean? This, this is, is your, this this is your is house? house? This is the Sheriff M house. I live here. Oh! What? This is your safe. Yeah. Oh, oh, that's why it looks 
so familiar. Yeah. Yeah, this is the safe. I've been trying so hard to get it open. So I found the safe in an abandoned town just down the street from here. And it was like hidden there. We brought it home. Okay. I hit it with a sledgehammer. I drove it over at the Hummer. And I even dropped it off like a huge lift and smashed it open. But I've only gotten it this far open. Oh, oh my gosh. Wow. Not very far. Not very oh, far. that's why it's all the dents and all this stuff in here. I've been doing whatever it takes to open it. But no luck. Well, Visa Master Safe Cracker. Do you mind if I give this a try and see if I can unlock this for you? Yeah, I'd love to. I'm so curious to know what's inside this thing. Dude, How long you... have you had this safe? It's been like a couple months now. It must be really hard to crack. I'm gonna actually try really hard. Yeah. I did bring some of my spy gear with me. So. Yeah, that's exactly what I think it's gonna need because we tried the brute force, but I think it needs a subtle touch now. Mm. Do you think you can get us some water? Because we've been traveling for so long. Did you, how'd you guys even get here? Uh, long story. We had to walk our whole entire way here. All the way from home? Yes, all the way from home. Wow. We walked walk through the woods. Wow, that is such a far walk. Let's go get you guys some water. Come right. on, let's Thanks. go. Water! Really? What? Oh, Millie! What are you doing here? Well, she lives here, I think. Oh, yeah, that's right. Are you tired, Chad? It's kind of crazy that we're at, we ended up at the sheriff's house. It's actually perfect, because now we have a place to sleep tonight. I don't want to walk into some random stranger's house and be like, hey, can we sleep here? And we don't have to spend the night camping outside. Yeah, true. Carter got us some waters here, but we're going to bring the waters over to the safe. And we're going to try to break this safe after we drink a little bit of water. <laughs> we are ready to crack the safe. V, are you ready? I am ready. So I actually bought a stethoscope with me. Mm -hmm. A doctor usually uses this to listen to your heart. Yeah. You can turn anything into a spy gear. If you're a ninja like Chad, you can turn anything into a ninja weapon. So I'm turning this stethoscope stethoscope into a listening spy device. This particular safe here has a dial. You can see it turns right and it turns left. Mm -hmm. And I'm gonna try and listen to this very carefully to hear if there's any slight sound difference. Mm. So then that will reveal um, a combination. So if you get it on the right number, you'll hear like a pin drop or something. Or like just a, um, like a stop. Oh, and then, okay. I'll, then I'll know. Okay. Okay. Kind of a spy 101 is that whenever you start a combination, you should always go to zero. So that's where you start. I'm not quite sure if this is like a two, three, or four code. I'm gonna start with three just because when I was in school and I had a locker combination, it's always a three number combo. So I'm just kind of try that out first. Yep. Whoa. The. The ghost meter's going off inside the backpack. Oh my gosh. What? What the Chad? Why is it going off in there? It's creepy. Yeah, the hair on the back of my neck started like standing up. Ugh. I'm gonna go back to the safe cracking here. Okay. You hear anything? No, I couldn't hear anything. I'm gonna try it one more time. I'm gonna try a full round all the way to the right and then a full round all the way to the left this time. I'm gonna turn really slowly counterclockwise okay. and then see if I can hear anything. Hmm, got kind of stuck here. Okay, it's really weird. I can't turn anymore. What? I can't. It's totally stuck? It's totally stuck. So see. stuck at 30. What number? is that, like 25? Yeah, it won't turn. Ah. So does that mean that it has to be 30? Has to be one of it? So does that, mean, it, does that mean you gotta turn the other direction now? Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah, I think you're getting close to cracking it then. So Okay, it's stuck again. Oh, it's stuck so again. So it's on 70 this time. So the first one was like 25 ish. And 25 now, or 30. Now and then it this looks is like it's oh, about 68, 68. 69. So I'm gonna try 25 and then 68. So I'm gonna start from zero again. 25. Uh huh. 68. Uh huh. Okay. Nothing? Oh! Wait. Wait. I heard a click. Yeah, you hear that? Oh my gosh. I feel like maybe there's like stages and yeah. this might be their first stage. Oh, okay. Oh okay, I'm gonna try 30 and then 70 this time. Okay. Because, because it stopped at 25 and 30. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna start back at zero. Here's 30. Uh-huh. 70. Huh, no click this time. Yeah. That must not be the right combination. Maybe the first stage the combination was right but maybe the second one is not. 
I do have one more spy gadget that I want to use. It's this invisible light. Okay, so I'm gonna shine it on here. Okay. Let me know if you guys see anything. Keep an eye on this, okay? Yeah, okay. Checking out the safe. I don't see anything on the handle. Is there fingerprints on the handle? Eh, a lot of dust. Do you mm, see anything? No, I don't see anything. All right, let's go on the side here. Okay. Uh, nothing on the side of the safe. What's that? Oh, what is that? Yeah, right here, guys. Maybe it's a fingerprint. It looks like my finger goes right on it. All right, let's see over here. Wait. Wait, what was that? Wait, whoa! Whoa! Check that out. It's a triangle! And what, what's in each corner? It looks like the bottom left corner is um, some sort of... I don't know what that is, I guys. I can't tell. Comment down below what this symbol is right here. I can't tell. And Actually, then... if you know any of the symbols, let us know. If any of these look familiar, maybe... Whoa! Oh my gosh, Chad. Maybe under dude, our cap? Dude, okay. we, we should better get out of here. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Right. Let's go, let's go. Oh Oh, is someone shooting at us or what? Oh, yeah, I'm coming. Okay. 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 That was so close. Those, like something okay. loud, loud and bangs. Or okay. Something. Yeah, it's almost like when we discovered that triangle. Yeah. Someone was like trying to attack us, and they didn't want us to find it. So that was really, really scary. I don't want to be here anymore. But thank you so much for all the notification ninjas. The first hour on every single time I post a new video. I'm showing you comments right here. Thank you for those of you who follow me on Instagram and been leaving me comments and solving all the mysteries and all the clues that I asked you guys to. Make sure to check out this video right here with me and Chad. Subscribe to me, subscribe to Chad. Okay, so I think we're really close, you guys. So make sure to let me know in the comments below if you know what those codes mean because that was really crazy. I'll see you guys next time, okay? Bye.